Go. All right. Hey, everybody. My name's Kevin. My friends call me. The tortoise guy. They call me other things, too, but we're not going there right now. <laughs> Alrighty. So, listen. We have so many people here, volunteers, right? Some don't want to be on camera. Stephanie. We got Daisy. We got a new guy, Curtis. We, who, everybody's doing great. We got our nieces coming for the first time. And, of course, Eternity and Robert. Mm -hmm. They're from Boston. Boston. All right, we got new tortoises here, right? That came in yesterday. Oh, right there, walking oh, around. Okay. There we go. All right, and you gotta take it over, okay? All right, All right, cool. Listen, so if a call comes in, you just hit the red button, okay? I'm gonna get the dogs outside just for a quick walk, and we're gonna pick up Nisa. So listen, everybody, it's great stuff. We have oh. how many babies and everything? They're gonna show you guys, right? All right. Yeah. Just have a nice end to it when you bring. Yeah. All right, sounds Bye, good. Guys. Hello. Hello. Okay. So what are you guys doing right now? We are giving the babies hey, no, no, no. Right some food. Okay. All right. Good. Giving them some smashed up peas so it's easier for them to eat. Oh, okay. okay, cool. So how many babies are in here total? Total we have 52. 52 babies? 52. 53? I think, I think it's 53. Okay. I believe it's 50 African Sokatas, the two red foot. Okay, and cool. And then the, the one marginated. There we go. Hello, little guy. Okay, cool. All righty. So, yeah, they're just, uh, they got their daily soaks in. Mm -hmm. And uh, right now we're just going to be feeding them uh, some yummy peas. Mm -hmm. So, they can never go wrong with these peas. Look at that. They love this stuff. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Yeah, we mashed it for them. We put it in a little microwave to warm it up. And now they're just going to be chowing down the entire day. It's kind of a gloomy day today here in L.A., but, you know, they're still doing fine. It should be, uh, oh, look at that. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> That's adorable. All right. And so are any of the, are all of these staying here? Are they going to be uh, going? What's so the deal with them? We are trying to get the African Sulcatas rehomed. Okay, cool. Um, as of now, the Redfoots are staying just because those are our miracle babies. Mm-hmm. But yeah, so we do have 50 African Sulcatas that need forever homes, and hopefully we can get them soon. Okay, so what's the rehoming process? Is there any steps, any requirements? Um, yeah, so pretty much you would get into contact with one of us, whether it's emailing Kevin, or if you see one of our posts like on Facebook or something, and just reaching out. Um, we do ask a couple questions, like what kind of setup you have for them, if you've had tortoises before, which even if you haven't, that's totally fine. We just kind of show you um, how to take care of them and stuff. You have like a crash course here, right? Yeah. For so an hour? You do need to come also and have a one-hour crash course. Um, we don't ship, so you do need to come pick them up here. Um, there is a rehoming fee of $100, but it is tax deductible, and the money does come back to the organization. So, yeah. And then you pretty much just come and take your little baby home. Okay, cool. Cool, very cool. All right, so yeah, I'll let you guys get back to it. All right, thank you so much. All right, and so over here, uh, you guys just saw the baby sulcata tortoises that are being rehomed, and in here, we actually have some that are being incubated. And so you still have this one. So out of 21 eggs, 20 of them hatched, we're still waiting for this little guy right here. So that's the last one. Back there is Lumpy's egg. I don't know if you all know Lumpy, um, but that's the best that she can do. Uh, this tiny little egg, you know, compared to this normal size looking Sokata egg. And over here we have the other uh, hatch of Sokata eggs along with one red foot egg. So we're really excited. Hopefully this one hatches because then we would have three that were here that were uh, hatched at Tortoise Land. And then over here, we have the babies that were dug up yesterday. So this is all from Shy Girl. All of these babies are from Shy Girl, which is amazing, considering there hasn't been a male here since last year, and that male has only been here for about three months. And so all these eggs that she's been producing is from that one time in the summer. So it's really incredible. And right here we have Squirt, the newest female red-footed tortoise that came yesterday. So very excited. She's been bullying Juvie a little bit. <clears throat> and over here we have, oh, is this marmalade? That is marmalade. Oh, I love this guy. Look at this little marmalade. 
so beautiful. Oh, oh my God. I love red-footed tortoises so much. They are such a fascinating tortoise species. Look at that. So cool. All righty. Let's see if we can find where. Oh, there is Lumpy. The one that I told you guys about. The one that can only produce that tiny egg. So, yep, that's her. So she's chilling. She, they all ate uh, in the morning time. So they're kind of just resting right now. Since I said, you know, it's a gloomy day outside here in L.A. So, all right. Very cool. Oh. And there, look, we got Spikosaurus Rex. Look at that. Oh, oh, he looks grumpy. <laughs> oh, very cool. And then we got, look, we got Big Red in here. Look at that. Big Red and other red-footed tortoises. And then right here we have Punk. Yeah, so he's a punk. All right, very cool, guys. All right. So just one last thing before I let you guys go. Here at Tortoise Land, you know, we are a nonprofit organization and we know we we love the help. We love the volunteers that come here to help out Kevin, you know, so hopefully we can have all those 53 babies rehomed, um, you know, because it would be really a big help. Because imagine what 53, 53 socata, big socata tortoises, tortoises here. So, yeah, we really do need the help. We really need these guys rehomed soon. So, hopefully we can uh, make something happen. So, look forward to seeing you guys again soon. So, get, take care.